Hi everyone, Justine Frolker here, author, speaker, corporate trainer, certified Daring Way and Dare to Lead facilitator, and we are in my February series that I don't really have a title for because I changed my mind last minute following the Super Bowl halftime show. The first week, we talked about how healthy cultures, healthy lives, healthy teams, healthy boards, healthy tables are not actually full of people who just agree with everything you agree with, okay? That they're, that healthy um, lives are diverse lives. And last week, we talked about how the phrase, we're just going to have to agree to disagree, is actually not conducive to healing and growth. And this week, I want to talk about um, what happens when it's an issue of right or wrong or integrity and things like that. And so um, in this curriculum and based off of the data, we use this definition of integrity. Choosing what is right over what is fun, fast, and easy. Choosing courage over comfort. And living out your values, not just professing them. That you actually walk out your values, not just talk them. And so some of the tough part about this work and when you lit, choose to live a courageous wholehearted life is that my definition of integrity might be very different than what your definition of integrity is. Your choosing right over what is fun, fast, and easy might be very different than mine. And um, this does not necessarily mean that one is right or wrong or better or worse. Now this is outside of things like righteous anger where people are being being treated immorally unethically dangerously things like that like that stuff makes me angry there is a right to that right not versus right or wrong okay however when we live in this world that is different and difficult and messy and very divided right now and it seems like very few of us are choosing the skills of courage. One of the things that we must lean into is that your definition of right might be different than mine. And I wanna seek to understand where you're coming from, just like we talked about last week. It is not my job to be judge or jury. I don't want that freaking job. It is my job as a daring leader, as someone who lives with and in courage, to seek to understand what's happening, that that is okay with you. And to hopefully ask you to seek to understand how come it's not okay with me. Not to try to convince you to come to my side, because that isn't helpful. People don't feel heard when you attempt to convince them to come to your side. When you lean in with curiosity and seek to understand where they're coming from, that's different. That's where growth and healing will happen because that's connection. So this week, your definition of what's right may be very different from the people around you. When is the last time you have done the work to really, to seek to understand where they're coming from and how come that right is okay with them. I'll see you next week for the last one. Gracie did not say hi to you this week. That's weird. I have lots of um, resources and teaches and videos on all of the platforms, YouTube, um, LinkedIn, Instagram, and Facebook. And of course, over at my website, justinefroker.com. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being courageous in your conversations in the comments below. And I will see you next week.